the longer you live on planet Earth, you start thinking about your legacy. When I was a little boy, the only thing was in my mind is sport, 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 sport. Sometimes girls, girls, girls. But when you become older and you live the life for so many years and it was always about you and your family maybe and your children, then you start wondering if I die today, what have I leave behind? Not only for my children, not only for my family, but what have I done for my neighborhood? What have I done for my country? What have I done for this world? A lot of us, we are living in what I call a rat race. That means that everybody is trying to become rich, to become famous, to have more, have, 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 have. And most of the time we miss the fact that God has made us to be a blessing and to leave a legacy behind, to leave words behind that young men can go back and listen to this word, to leave a life behind that people can see like an example, to leave a legacy behind that many years after today, people will go and try to find the life lessons that you have left behind. Look at Jesus. Jesus came so many years ago. He came and spoke so many great works. But he didn't even alone spoke the words, but he also lived the words. And today the whole world is trying to find out what did he mean by saying that. Do you want to be somebody that when you die, nobody even knows that you ever lived because you lived a life without purpose and you didn't leave a legacy behind? Or would you like to be a person that would start thinking from today about the future, about if I die, what will I leave like legacy behind? What can I teach somebody who's coming after me? I think it's very important in these days that the more we get older, and even if you're young, it's even better if you start thinking very young about your legacy. Because what is a legacy? A legacy is what you leave behind. A legacy is what you want people to think about you. When your name is called, like Nelson Mandela, that everybody knows he was fighting against apartheid. When your name is called, like Dr. Martin Luther King, that everybody knows that he was, he was fighting against racism. When your name is called like LeBron James, that you name that one is one of the greatest basketballers that ever lived. But when your name is called like Mother Teresa, then you know this was the young, simple, old mother that looks behind, looks after, that looks after the children in the neighborhood. What will you leave behind? What will be your legacy? Think about it.